What the Barbican is, is an art centre. And an art centre is somewhere where all the different art forms sit side by side. So we would be foolish to let them sit separately, because the interesting thing is about how they can all relate to each other. It was really inspiring on the first day, I think, when kind of all the different Barbican groups came together, the drummers, the future band, the poets, the filmmakers, and the dancers, of course. It was really amazing, a good atmosphere in the room. Dream, but dream with meaning. Let your dreams move and blossom with the seasons. Dream without ceasing. Dream knowing this will be achieved. It was really important to us that we would be able to work with young people, um, but also work with guest artists and musicians from different backgrounds, different genres, different countries, and find ways of, of creating new things together. I think the benefits of bringing the Guildhall and Barbican together are that you uh, develop a community of practice, a community of learning and of arts practice that brings together both students training for the profession in music, art and theatre, and the profession itself. But what we have now is more and more crossover going on artistically and educationally between the two organisations. It's like there's no like boundaries for what you can do and what you can't do. You're always finding new things and it's always really, really, really fun. I think this is a really, really important moment for an art centre because a lot of artists are now not working only in one art form but are working across a lot of very different art forms and here they can do that more easily than perhaps in a single art form institution. The more people and organisations and groups can be brought together in a level playing field where there's no sense of hierarchy of those who know and those who don't know, then things start to happen. I, I just think it's been people being in a room together or in a place together, that's how barriers start to get broken down.